This year, on the 29th of March, a normal day, I posted a poll to decide my next hardcore challenge. <laughs> Onto my YouTube community tab. And if you don't believe me, cool. well... If I stop moving, I play out again! This challenge was submitted by Game Nights 237. If you too have ideas for challenges, leave them in the comments and I'll put them up to poll. Thanks! And we're gonna begin our time traveling adventure by playing Ultra Kill, cause I know all you guys just wanna see me ra- I mean, I mean, we won, right? Now, Ultra Kill might just be the perfect game for this challenge, right? Cause it's a movement shooter and you move anyways. However, we're gonna start the Leviathan level, cause I think it'll suit this challenge pretty good. And there we go. Alright. So, this challenge will work as following. I, I, I I'm basically have to move all the time. Yeah? Yeah, and, and, and that's everything. <laughs> pretty basic, pretty, no, pretty easy to understand, right? And there he is! Big Hentai Dude! What up, bro? Long time no see, right? Now rocket riding makes this boss fight really easy though. We hit second phase and I don't know from what he just took the massive amount of damage but he did. And we're gonna finish this off with style. Oh, he survived. Okay, let's actually not choke this. <laughs> Alright. There he goes. Leviathan dead. And the secret ocean gate opens up. Well, unfortunately, I count this cutscene as not moving, so let's move on. Hey, peering. Not bad. Okay, and for the second game on our list, a game from 2015, Rocket League. But this time, I'm not gonna play alone, because we have Max! Hey, it's me again! Do you guys remember? Okay, that was. I have nothing to add. Just kommt mir in rein. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Okay, let's go. Okay, so here's how it'll work. Obviously, I have to keep moving, so scoring a goal just isn't an option as it would restart the game position and keep you locked in place for the count on being. So instead, Max will have to defend me and the goal from getting scored or destroyed, as it would end the challenge for this game. However, we still would have tried to score a goal at the last possible second to still win this if... Uh, that just didn't happen. Okay, let's go. Are you ready? I am ready to rock! To defend me, because I need you. Okay, I'm out of position again. Already. Uh oh. No, 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 it is not him. What? Don't, don't score, don't score. <laughs> I can't, no, no, no. Yeah. No, no, defense. Ball oh, okay, possession yes. perfect, is the perfect. key. This was great game. To play. succeed in this I'm challenge. I'm going at, okay, you're going, going to attack. Oh, almost. No problem. Hold no problem. it off, hold it off. Oh. No problem at all. Pressing it. <laughs> <laughs> no, you got you no, I don't. Oh my god. Um, that's not, that's uh, not happening. Okay, I next game. <laughs> okay, bye! <laughs> bye! Okay, and the third game we're gonna time travel to is Payday 2 from 2013. And this game was actually wished by one of you guys, so here you go. But we also are dragging along Max again. Well, hey, it's me again from Rocket League. I am a very bad player in this game, but I'm better than Damien. Because he never played this game, I guess. That's true, but still Max is supposed to be my teacher here, cause... I've only played one mission with him before, and he basically knows what's happening, but I don't, so yeah, let's see how this goes. Let's go! Okay, so basically we are gonna steal an EMP bomb, and well, that's it. Quite easy! Okay. Okay, okay, don't stop moving. Yeah, okay, I forget about this. Oh look, you have Bowie, Bowie and, and have chains. chains. Boah, chains looks like a baller. Oh, uh, we need to get, get to the trains. Find the murky trains. Okay, that's. If he got, got caught, it's it's over. So we need to be stealthy. quite careful. Yes, and stealthy. Be, be stealthy and stay healthy.
What? Camera drones? Where the hell? Oh, there. Can I you see any? I see one, yes. This, this, this uh, white light is oh. a camera drone, I guess. <laughs> Why yeah. is it so stationary? They had no chance in this challenge. Yeah. Oh! Ah! oh, whoa, whoa. One of these Robocop cameras is uh, above us. Okay, we can enter here. Or maybe over, over at your They place? have a huge field of view, though. Okay, uh, let's just enter here, right? How? Oh, you. Uh, I have to cut this. This is just. Why? With my. Oh, that was easy. Huh? Um, Whoa, you're so quick. Wait. Oh! Wait, do I have to crouch? Yes, yes. Yeah. We have to hack the, the train. Oh, wait, I can. You can just open I can it? open the door. Wow. Hello. High security. Boah! Nothing here. Oh, this looks like money, but we are looking for a bomb. Your ass is the bomb. Wait. And I do have some bad news. There is a bomb at this wedding as well. What? Your butt. Your butt is the bomb. There will be no survivors. I love you so much. Wait. <laughs> <laughs> this is a Brooklyn Nine-Nine reference. You. Oh, I never watched it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Oh! Well, easy. We Can him? we knock him out? Well, well, we could kill him. We could knock him out with the bullet. Oh, hey! Okay, knocked him out. That's not very family friendly. Oh, I found uh. the entrance. Oh, okay. Boah! Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Yeah, okay. I, uh, I'm scared. It's Can I go side. down there or will I stop yes, moving? It. Uh, no, no, you can go, go down D there. Did you have any instance of not moving? Uh, wait, wait, let me check. Let me check this. Oh, no, it's very smooth. Uh, going up is very smooth and going down. Just press the uh, WK key uh, all the time and you're going down very smoothly. Oh, yeah. Okay. Cool. I don't know where we are. Next so. Oh, wait, there's a guard. Oh, yeah. No, he's going away again, uh, I think. Oh, I saw him. Where are we? I don't know what, what we are I thought going we were supposed to hack the train. Well, maybe it's a, a tube. Oh no, how Americans say subway? Su subway is. Oh, okay. okay, wait, wait, wait. Americans say subway and the English people say tube, I guess. Uh, yeah. Uh, uh, Could be. I'm not I sure. I think that's correct. I'm an international boss, you know. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Moving away. <laughs> international boss. Yeah. Oh, there's another one. Okay. Uh, then I will keep moving. Whoa! But how? What are we going to hack in the in, in this dirt pla dirty place? I think we have to go back up, back back to the overground. Whoa! Whoa! Where? Okay, you can come here where I am. It's quite cool. I'm coming. We can have a romantic date here. Romantic? Yeah. Just by the candles. Put on some some candles, some music. Okay. Oh, we can go up. And people yep, say my accent is heavy. <laughs> 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 yeah, mine is quite heavy too. Quite thick. Oh, okay, I got. I got. But where's the charm without a heavy accent, right? Exactly. Okay, we need. Okay, we need to hack this train. Oh, but how? Oh, no. won't open. He oh my oh, god, whoa, that, was that was close. That was quite close. Are you safe there? I'm safe. <laughs> it's so stressful moving all the time. Okay, I th I think the uh, control panels are somewhat in the middle of the trains. Uh oh. Okay, Wait. he's going the other way. Okay, maybe we can now move around here. The drone is moving away. Here's some. Hello there. Drone? <gasps> ah, it's an electrician. Oh, okay. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, there's a guard. Oh my god. Okay, we are we are somewhat threat, I guess. No, we are not. Can I just sneak past him? I can. He's basically blind. Whoa. <laughs> oh my god. The light turned red. If you if you catch, caught. I feel caught. Huh? Ah, uh, the drone, the drone, the drone. Oh no! Oh, careful. Wait! Oh my god! What? Did it catch Did you? I? Oh my god! I just made it. I no, think. No, 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 no! It catches you. Ah, oh, it caught. Oh, yes. <laughs> okay, let's just kill everyone. <laughs> okay. Okay. I this, like the uh, plan. I'll go a Kimbo. I'm moving very slowly, pew, 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 pew. but I'm still moving. 
Oh, <laughs> a single headshot. Oh, it okay. wasn't a headshot. I right. don't know. Oh, I have found a control panel. Finally. Come around here. Okay, I would just want to show. Okay, never mind. Huh? Where we lost. Where? It was a sneaky mission. We had to uh, be silent. We, we failed. Were. We failed, yes. Uh, damn. <laughs> Sad, but it went better than the Rocket League game. <laughs> True. <laughs> okay, next game. Next game, but bye. But we're gonna have to say, yeah, bye to Max, because... From now on, on it's solo player games again. Bye. And for the age of 2011, we are going with the version 1.0 of Minecraft. This is bound to be very nostalgic. So let's just create a new world, survival with it. Damn, generating worlds was so quick back then. That and no legs at all at the start. Crazy. Just wonky mountains like this. And dead. Damn. So, since we can't do anything else, let's go explore the mountains. Hey, that's actually a very nice landscape, isn't it? Oh, over there are squids. Cause back in the days, they could still generate in just any body of water, not just in the river biome. Crazy. And oh my god, the walking sounds. They aren't annoying at all. <gasps> Creepers! And original gravel! Ooh, pressing F1 works. Didn't know that was implemented yet. Hello, Miss. Oh, four! And a zombie. Why is he so jumpy? I'm so happy! Damn, prehistoric creepers have no chill at all. They just explode immediately. They don't even consider defusing themselves if they get, if they are too far from you. That's a pretty nice. nice landscape. If this was a normal let's play, I'd definitely build my house here. Well, actually, let's make that the goal for this game right here, all right? So let me just chop down some trees. Yep, that's not stressful or annoying. Oh, oh, I'm keep missing the block. <laughs> Just don't hit the leaves, bro. Okay, but there's still that issue that I can't go into my inventory. Because that would prevent me from moving, right? So I have no choice but to use raw blocks. Like dirt and, and those logs. Okay. Let's do some terraforming. Build a nice foundation for our new home. Alright, just have to get rid of this corner, I guess. <laughs> Old saplings, so goddamn ugly! Prehistoric Minecraft really was something. <gasps> wolves! Ooh, maybe if you survive the night, we get some bones to tame a wolf. Now, I'm thinking, if we could somehow get on top of these spruce trees, right? We could punch a hole in the middle. Uh, did I just did I just make a fish splash sound? Wait, I'm splashing. <laughs> Can you hear the splash sound? Damn, the alpha was so quirky. <gasps> we can't sprint. Sprinting is impossible. There wasn't sprinting implemented yet. Ah oh, man. Well, that just means I have to build my way to a treetop. Like... That... So now, I can punch a hole in the middle and get this minimal movement in. Okay, but this is taking pretty long. And I'm out of dirt so I can't get on top of more trees, which makes this whole process even more painful. And as if that wasn't enough, now it's getting night time. Amazing. Okay, let's just hurry back and build what we can build. Hey, our first tree has grown. Oh no, already getting attacked and I'm out of building blocks. Pfft. That's an amazing house. Won't you agree? Oh no, I'm actually pretty close to dying. Easy. 
And we should be able to eat something and still be moving. Yep. Cool. They dropped so much rotten flesh back then. Crazy. Now if we could somehow kill that skeleton, we'd get a dog. But maybe we can get a skeleton to shoot a dog. Uh. Uh oh. There's another one. Uh oh. Uh oh. A uh, bad idea maybe. Fuck! I just wanted a dog! Well, next game. Next up, we have a game from 2001, which is very dear to me. It's Jack and Dexter, the Precursor Legacy. And we're gonna start this challenge right after this cutscene. Cause first off, we're gonna take off to Misty Island. I've gone ahead and skipped through some levels, cause... Well, they were littered with cutscenes and they would've obstructed the challenge. So I figured we're gonna start off with this level instead. Alright, we're here. Now let's start this challenge. Now, the Jack and Dexter trilogy is by far, well not by far, there are still Dark Souls, but my favorite gaming series. While the first part which we are playing right now is focused on exploration, jump and run and collecting stuff, the second one already is a time travel paradox and uh, uh, and basically GTA 6. Hey, I see the sculptor's news. Yeah, so right now we are on a quest to catch this muse which will in return uh, Earn us a power cell from, from the sculpture. You don't need to know about the story really. That's just a side quest. Oh no. Ah, don't stop moving even if I fall. Okay. So something noteworthy about this game is that it's the first open world game with no loading screens whatsoever. Which earned it a record in the record books along with some other pretty cool records which I'm gonna put on the screen because I can't remember all of them right cool so where did that muse run off I don't think we'll make it back. there it is hey come here Oh damn, it's quick. Can I make the jump? Ooh, just like that. Now technically, I stopped moving by grabbing onto the ledge, but let's not take it too serious. Cause I really want to play some of this game. <gasps> we got it! Uh, oh no, it plays a cutscene. Ah, oh, I'm an idiot! I should have done that way later. <laughs> Ah uh, man, that's that's really unfortunate. <sighs> okay, next game. And now we traveled far enough back in time to leave the 2000s era and start off with a game from 1989, which will be Medieval. It's a PS1 game, and it's a pun, basically between Medieval, the time, the age, or whatever you want to call it, and Evil, the um. Well, evil. <laughs> okay, and we're gonna start the challenge now, cause we can move. So immediately, you should recognize this game as a Souls-like, right? But here's the catch. This game is older than Dark Souls. So you could call it the very first Dark Souls, not Dark Souls, Souls-like, not Souls-like. But, but, but I'm gonna tell you, you can't control your camera. It, it moves however the fuck it wants. Okay, okay, stop, please. Chill, guys. We have a lot of HP and those basic zombies don't do much of damage, so... We're fine, even with an assault attack like that. So in this game, you play this undead skeleton and your goal is to defeat the evil sorcerer Serok. Who, who basically wants to enslave the whole world, I guess. He's also the one who reawakens. Come on, die. All those undeads 
the zombies and stuff. But because he reawakened all undeads, that includes us, the hero of the story, Sir Daniel Fortescue. And our goal is it to defeat Zerok and undo the spell basically. So it's a pretty unique, pretty amazing game, which had a lot of impact in my life. I mean, you can see the similarities between this guy and my channel, right? Okay. So let's just continue with the level, I guess, right? There are a lot of zombies here, but we just don't care. Also, I just I just noticed those green zombies suspiciously look like the Minecraft zombies, right? But this game is older than Minecraft. Hmm. Or maybe this is just the first color of a zombie you think about. Okay, so right now I'm trying to fill up the soul chalice. We're at 80% right now and you fill it by just defeating enemies, right? You fill it with their souls and then you can collect it and trade it in at the hall of heroes for some more weaponry. Also, there's a secret chest over here. If you just maneuver around those narrow landscapes. There we go. Okay, so there's the soul chalice. We, we can't pick it up right now because we haven't filled it up. See, I can run through it. So I'll just kill some more zombies, which will be right over here. 92% and the remaining percent will be over here. Yeah. Fresh from the grave, back to the grave. There. Now we can collect the soul chalice. Also, there's another chest and another one. So let's hurry back and get the soul chalice. Got it. Let's continue with the level then. So if this game interests you and you want to play it too. Uh, I found the duck station emulator to go best with this game. Over there. This dude is a vendor. You could buy some items from him, but if I did, we would stop moving, so I can't. Instead, let's just continue on with this level. Nah, he tripped. Pretty cool, right? This game is crafted with so much love and you can you can really feel it through the screen. The voice actor of our main character voice acted him with a bucket on his head. To sound more Skeleton-like without a jaw, right? Ah, well. There's the end. By the way, if, if you were wondering, there's just another shield in this chest. Stuttering, goddamn. Okay, so unfortunately, the level is over and I have to leave this game. <sighs> but thanks for watching. We're gonna continue with the next one. Now, for the last game on our list, we're gonna play Pong, which is from 1972 and the oldest game which is still playable on PC I could find. So, we control the left bar and I think as long as my bar keeps moving, I should still be in, uh, in the rules of this challenge. So let's see if we can <sighs> win against, oh my god, win against the engine with this handicap. Oh my god. I, I, I think I'm actually the worst Pong player to ever exist. Am I? Oh. <laughs> crazy gameplay. Oh my god, I'm stupid. Whoa, I'm extra. Oh my god, I'm extraordinary bad. Oh my. <laughs> Oh, this is embarrassing. Oh, fuck. <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. Please. I can't lose this. I gotta, I gotta go into hyper mode. Focus. Oh, he got that. 
Yeah! Okay, okay, okay. Bounce is back, bounce is back. Why? <laughs> Why is Pong actually exciting? I thought it would be the most boring thing ever. Well, it probably still is to watch, right? But woo! Right now, I'm about to get obliterated by an engine. But oh. Six nine, hey! Of course I did that on purpose. Huh? Oh, it goes past ten points. Interesting. No. Okay. Well, <laughs> that was embarrassing. But <laughs> anyway, thanks for watching. If you have any more ideas for any more challenges, please leave them in the comments, and I'll get to them. Thanks for watching again, and see you. Bye.